Okay, I'm recording. That whole episode was a high concept. People might have thought that <laughs> I sounded really stupidly tired and like I've had an annoying week. That's made me feel on edge and confused by everything. They might have thought that um, you were just plugging the Patreon endlessly, <laughs> nonstop. Out of guilt yeah, no, or, no. I don't know. But it was all actually breadcrumbs to lead you here. Mm-hmm. To this <laughs> high concept, it's really like a, um, I don't know. Imagine mm-hmm. I said something clever there. Well, it's, a, it's like an, an Andy Kaufman bit, right? Where you're like, are we in on it? You know, are are we, is is the joke uh, us? Is the joke the medium? Is the joke you as the audience? Uh, and uh, and that's just sort of the 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 meta textual experience of consuming except, except with fifty five. If, if it was Andy Kaufman, yeah, it would be a joke. But for us, it's more of a marketing um, right. activation. Look, at Andy so Kaufman speak. was a famous guy on a sitcom. He was not above marketing himself. Yeah, he. I think Andy Kaufman invented the personal brand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, truly. But look, like Andy Kaufman would have a Patreon. Like if Drill has a Patreon, I think it's fair to say that, you know. True. Uh, no, we, actually, no one else does have Patreons except for us. And I noticed that um, our guest was plugging his Patreon at the end of the episode, but. That's um, not right. That's, no, it's. it's uh, that was an I, error. I'm pretty sure it's just us and Jordan Peterson, who, of course, is where we got the idea from. Because we're, I was uh, thinking the other day, like. What would do you think we could get Jordan Peterson and also should we? <laughs> would that be crossing a line or would it be so good to make him lower himself? Yeah, I mean, who do you think is like worse, Leo Dio or Jordan Peterson? Well, that's a great question because we are going to be revisited by Leo Dio um, in this <laughs> <Right>. episode. <laughs> so, so pay us money to uh, hear us uh, listen to just bad people. Yeah. Uh, Sam's Sam's not upset yet by all the covers of Carousel, and that is going to change very soon. So <laughs> but are you saying you already are? Like, you started this whole <laughs> night already upset? I'm I'm, I'm just, like, kind of grumpy today, to be honest. Oh, and I'm hoping to send you send that grumpiness over to you. <laughs> right, it's like the ring. <laughs> like, <laughs> you're just, if you force me to listen to an hour and a half of uh, Carousel <laughs> covers, it's the same as watching a cursed VHS tape. Just my soul will be infected. Exactly. Cool. So uh, now we're behind the paywall. We can talk about how we really feel about Jordan Peterson. I'm just – all I'm trying to say is like – I agree. You know. (laughs) I will say this. I think one reason I'm grumpy, to be honest, is that um, we got home from a trip and then right back into life. Everything's been chaotic Mm. and my – the – the extra room in our apartment that I use as an office is like horrifyingly messy right now. And whenever I'm in here, I just feel angry. But I also have not forced myself to clean it yet. So I think that's where like Jordan Peterson really could be helpful to me. Right. Because one of the rules for life is like it's like wash your dick and clean your room type thing. Yeah, and I haven't done either of those things today. Damn. So I, I just think like I'm I'm also like in a bad mood, but I think it's because um, so many of the of the uh, women that I work with wear um, lipstick. <laughs>